Madison Riley. It has been an honor to walk alongside you, hold you, cherish you, laugh and cry with you in these past months. Becoming the husband, your husband is the greatest honor of my life. I see in you, I see responsibility, faithfulness, and the fear of the Lord. I see a, a tender heart of compassion, reconciliation, and forgiveness, a heart that lives to worship the Lord. I love you so deeply. I promise to choose to love you no matter what I'm feeling in my heart. I promise to be forever, faith, forever faithful to you and to the Lord, and to love you just the best way I can by making the Lord the first priority in my life and you the second. I promise to confide in you and not hide from you, and to communicate through difficulty rather than run from conflict out of fear. I promise to choose reconciliation with you and with the Lord. I promise to forgive you when I have been hurt deeply. I promise to rejoice with you always in thankfulness to the Lord, for we have been richly blessed. I promise to never stop pursuing you and to never stop growing and to never stop seeking the Lord. I love you. Jonathan David, <laughs> I'm so honored to walk alongside you in this life, to journey with our eyes fixed on Jesus, seeking to bring kingdom together as your wife. When I look at you, I see a man who loves the Lord and others with his whole heart, who lays down his life to serve others, someone who is teachable, passionate about learning, and pursues with his full attention without distraction. Jonathan David, I choose you today and every day to love you not based on my human capacity to love, but pouring out from the unwavering, steadfast love of our Father. I choose you, Jonathan, to be my husband, to trust you with my heart, to respect and honor you. I promise to be faithful to you and our Lord, to cherish you, to be a place of refuge and safety, to speak the truth in love. I promise to lean into the Holy Spirit and seek to grow to be more like Jesus to communicate through the hard conversations, to apologize when I fall short and pursue forgiveness, and to seek to understand. I promise to encourage you in your gifts, to challenge you, to celebrate you, and to laugh with you until our eyes are full of tears and our bellies hurt. May Jesus be our cornerstone, our rock and foundation. May we rely on the Holy Spirit as our guide and our counselor. And may we live to praise, honor, and, glor and bring glory to our Father in heaven all of our days, forever and always. Jonathan, <laughs> on behalf of the power vested in me, first and foremost and most importantly by God, and secondarily by the state of Pennsylvania, which is necessary, <laughs> I now pronounce you husband and wife. John, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> announce for the first time officially <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Jonathan Thank you. 